Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is Saturday, June 9th, 2018, and on March 31st, 2018, my family and I did go to Corkscrew Saloon in Medina, Ohio. Of course, that was a while back. Sorry for the delay, but I'm going to take you through the lunch that my family had, and here we go. Here is a shot of my daughter, Evelyn, and coming up is Brayden, who is three years old. We've got three shots of the interior, and there's a nice swanky little place. You can see part of the bar here, and then another shot of the dining area there. Okay, first up are the duck bacon wontons. These are fresh pressed wontons filled with duck bacon, cheese, and corn relish, served with mango chutney. And these wontons, ladies and gentlemen, were excellent everything worked harmoniously together including the sauce and here we have Braden and Evelyn nomming on the kids penne pasta and meatballs it says tossed with our tomato tomato basil sauce and complemented with two meatballs now the marinara is light and fresh the pasta unfortunately is store-bought and the meatball needs to be a little bit lighter, like if you were to use, you were to use a what, what would be called a panade, where it is a combination of milk and bread to try to aerate the meatball itself. Luckily, this dish is just for kids because it needed more herbage and garlic seasonings. This bread is killer. Apparently, it is made in-house and it is soft ooey gooey and doughy. Now these pierogies are what Corkscrew Saloon calls Red Bliss pierogies. And Red Bliss of course is a type of potato. It says Cleveland's own Ohio City pierogies which would be a company in Cleveland stuffed with roasted red potatoes and cheese sauteed with Vidalia onions complemented with sour cream. The pierogies were perfectly sauteed and crispy and had a delicious filling. Here is the accompanying salad. And my dinner here is the barbecue ribs, which are tender St. Louis cut barbecue ribs, grilled with our sweet barbecue sauce served with french fries, Asian slaw, and our house side salad, which you just saw. This is a half slab, and I'm going to take you through it. Now, the fries, as you can see, were battered, which means they were out of a bag and uh, definitely needed some work. They should have been freshly cut. The slaw on the right-hand side, you can see, is sweet, but pretty good. The ribs are kind of just okay because they were too sweet and they did not have enough of that savory rub that they needed. They, the server did bring out a brown sugar rub but that was sweet on top of sweet, so that's not what I needed. However, overall it was a good try to try to uh, nail some ribs, but there was no smoke flavor. And here is a shot of that brown sugar rub. This is Stephanie's Lobster Domenico, which is succulent lobster stuffed ravioli sauteed with shrimp scampi, Roma tomatoes and baby spinach tossed in our pesto blush sauce and finished with feta cheese. Excuse me. Now, this lobster ravioli dish was okay and the cheese was too bitter. So for dessert, on the left hand side we have a raspberry chiffon cake which was nice, it was light and fresh, and tasted like cheesecake so that was a winner. To the right of that we have the chocoholic cake which lives up to its name. It's pretty good, and it's rich and moist. So this is Corkscrew Saloon. They did a good job uh, with the overall meal. They've been in business for a while now. It used to be another restaurant called Penny's Poorhouse years ago. I believe that was the name of it anyway. Um, 
and we you know to, to review the meal we had the kids penne uh, pasta and meatballs the duck bacon wontons which were phenomenal the bread excellent pierogi is very good ribs fries ribs and fries were a mess the lobster ravioli was you know nothing to write home about and the desserts were pretty good so overall again good job I recommend going for those uh, dishes that I that I highlighted uh, as well as any others that I did not or and you can try those this is corkscrew saloon in Medina Ohio check it out as always I thank you guys very much for watching please subscribe to the channel leave any comments that you like let me know what you like what you didn't like and what you'd like to see share and I hope you guys have a great day today which is Saturday June 9th 2018 thanks very much for watching and take care bye bye